an approximation of a number is close to but not equal to the exact value of that number. The reality is that we rarely need the exact value of a quantity. We are usually required to approximate in one of the following three ways. Round into a certain place value, expressing a value to a given number of decimal places, or expressing a value to a given number of significant figures. In this video, we will cover rounding to a certain place value. To express a number to a particular place value, we identify that place value and we keep that digit and everything to the left of it. We zero all digits to the right. If the first digit to be zeroed is 5 or greater, we add 1 to the last non-zero digit. We then exclude the zeros that are not important. The link to my video on which zeros are important are in the description below. The following examples illustrate the idea. 98,354.21 We have to round this to the nearest thousand. The steps to be followed are here from the previous slide. So we need to identify which one is the thousand place. We see that the 8 is in the thousand place. So we are going to zero all the digits to the right of the thousand place. Then, if the first zero digit is 5 or greater, we have to add 1 to the last non-zero digit. The first zero digit is 3. This is not 5 or greater, so we do nothing. Then we exclude the zeros that are not important. Second example, we have 54.2193705. We want to round this to the nearest hundredths. The 1 falls in the hundredths place, so we're going to zero all the digits to the right of that place. Then the first zero digit was a 9. So we're going to add 1 to the last non-zero digit. We're going to add 1 to the 1 in the hundredths place. When we add 1 to 1, we get 2. And we exclude the zeros that are not important. Third example, we have 34.75, we want to round to the nearest whole number. This is the same as rounding to the nearest ones. So we zero all the digits to the right of that place. The first digit zeroed was a 7. So we add 1 to the last non-zero digit. We add 1 to the 4 to get 5. And we exclude the zeros that are not important. We have 9.9998. We want to round it to the nearest hundreds, just as before. We identify the places. We're going to zero the ones to the right of that place. So we're going to add one to the hundreds place. If you do not understand this fully, please check out my videos on addition of decimals where this concept will be explained further. As usual, we exclude the zeros that are not important. Do not be confused. These two zeros are not important but we are asked for it we are asked to express the number to the nearest hundreds so we leave them in ordinarily we would remove these two non-important zeros to be left with only the whole number 10. i am mr dubey see you in the next video